today I'm going to teach you guys how to make this shirt that I first made when I started the apparel part of Koala Art and Design, and I hope you guys like it. Okay guys, so what you want to do is you're going to be watching this YouTube as I am talking to you, which is really confusing, but in my little description there's going to be images, and there will be three, which will be a feather, a rib cage, and a lightning bolt. And what you're going to do is copy that link, and then you're going to open a new window and paste that link in. Once you have pasted your image into Paint, you're going to go to File, Print Setup. Make sure you do Fit to 2x2. Two two. Fit to 2x2. Two two. Otherwise, you're going to be printing a million pages and you're going to be very angry at me. So, File, Page Setup, Fit to 2x2 two two pages. Press OK. If you want to check this, go to Print Preview, and you'll see your image come up on two pages. So it should only print four pages. If you notice your printer printing way more, make sure you press Cancel, otherwise you're going to be printing a book. That's not good. Don't print a book. What we're going to need is our computer stencil, which we just printed out, which we have right here. I've laid it out. And we're going to need spray paint, scissors, or an X-Acto knife, fabric markers if you want to do the heart on the ribcage shirt we're going to do, white shirt, piece of poster board. So first what we're going to do is lay out our stencil. You're going to tape it together and then you're going to tape it down to the board, poster board. And then we're going to use our X-Acto knife to cut out the lines to make a giant stencil. And once we've done that, your stencil is going to look something like this. Very big. I already cut it up so we don't have to sit and watch us do that. So once we have it cut out, we can actually spray it onto our shirt. easier ways to do the splatter markings, I think, is just to spray into your cap, like this, and then just to whip it. So just whip your cap. And this is so you don't end up, because I know a lot of the times if you spray the cap the right way, you can make little splats, but sometimes you'll end up spraying a line across your shirt, which looks really crappy. So don't do that. Just spray into your cap and then whip it, and then I'll make those really nice splats. So if you want to do splattering, do that. Another really cool thing I've seen people do is if you tape, like use tape and tape lines. So if you tape a line like this and then spray, and then you can take your lines off and it'll make like stripes. And then you just splat. So be creative. You can use my stencils, use tape, tape crazy lines. Show me what you guys do. I'd love to see it. 